Hey guys, what's going on? Bring you a video on Zoom Z Crawl. Uh, I got the black sapphire here, and also the California 420. Um, the first thing I noticed about it was it, it feels different. It, uh, I don't really know how to explain it. it, just doesn't feel the same as the worms and everything else that Zoom makes. Um, I like it a lot. I do a lot of jig fishing, and so I figured I'd use this as a trailer. But I also wanted to see what it would look like in the water. So that's what I'm going to show you guys. I started off by throwing the Z-Crawl by itself into the water and that wasn't working very well. So I ended up putting it on this uh, jig. I'm not sure the company uh, that the jig is, but it's a half ounce, uh, black and blue. And I just put it on there like I do all my other jigs and uh, let it sit a little bit, twitched it. Um, lifted the rod tip up just to show it kind of sliding across the ground and I really noticed that the tail on this Z crawl is fatter at the towards the end which gives it a really good really good look when it goes through the water So next I tried the Texas rig with the Z-Craw and I'm using a 3-aught Gamagatsu offset hook and the thing I like about this bait is it has a slit in the back and in the belly to hide your hook into so you can just pinch the end of it in there and make it weedless. Um, I'm using a 3 16 black bullet head weight with I believe it's 8 pound mono as a line and uh, I also do fish these type of baits like this as well just uh, usually with a heavier weight for punching through lily pads um, and getting down into brush and all that So there it is, that's kind of what it looks like underwater. Um, if you like the video, please leave a like. Uh, if you have any questions and want to see a different type of bait being used, leave a comment. Have a good day.